Yo, it's me, Kifiano, West Side in the building, man, 100 grand. Uh, Y'all can follow me on Instagram at Kifiano, K E E F Y Y A N O. That's the same thing as YouTube, Facebook, everything else. You mean SoundCloud too. Definitely go subscribe to my YouTube, Kifiano, because more videos is coming. We out the way. And if you don't, we all. What's, what's the joint you be doing, though? <laughs> nah, I'm just talking about the hit. <laughs> I ain't chilling. Listen. With the scope, with a beam, I still find it. Y'all niggas be throwing shit, we still shining. Success is gonna come as our time. Cause we grinding. We grinding. It's take over Thursday, let me remind them. Cause we grinding. We grinding. It's take over Thursday, let me remind them. Take over and be the gang, and we grinding. With the scope, with a beam, I still find it. Y'all niggas be throwing shit, we still shining. Success is gon' come as our time Cause we grinding, we grinding It take over Thursday, let me remind them Cause we grinding, we grinding It take over Thursday, let me remind them You already know that this is your boy Kifiano Straight from the west side You now to the end of the Takeover Files What's going on, it's your boy Little Takeover This is the Takeover Files, man You already know what we got He told y'all we on the west side And... I'ma just say this young boy right here. Uh, uh, I'ma do a little, I'ma bring it back a little bit. Alright, I'm scrolling through my man. We already know shout out DJ Crazy, you feel me? Scroll through my man John and I see he had a little he performing somewhere, uh, getting it popping. Then I see some boy just I'm the hottest from West, I'm just stuck on. Oh, you niggas ain't safe with that little West vest. Though. I'm like, damn, hold on, who this? So so I do some research and then then I see Philly Scoop Paul hop on it. Yeah. I said, oh yeah, boy, boy. So I'm like, let me go, let me go on you uh, iTunes. This how I know it's real. You on iTunes? I type in who the ops, pop up on iTunes. It's yeah. over. I'm, I'm a fan, bro. My man Kiffy Yano, what ready. up, bro? What's up with you? You are ready, man. Joe about to take off. It's only 2020, just the beginning. Definitely, bro, man. And that's why I want. I just want to. Right now, I feel like a lot of people want to know just who you are. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, so uh, let them know for a little bit who, a little bit about you. Who are you? All right. Well, I go by the name of Kiffy Yano. My rap name used to be K Live. A lot of people used to call me K Live, but I, I changed it because it was getting old to me. So I mean, Kiffy, I know it fit me more. I mean, it grew my hair a little bit. So now it's like, yeah, I know. You feel me? Um, I'm from. I'm originally from West, but I was raised in Southwest. But you know, I'm a claim where I'm from when right. I was born at. So West Side, 54th and Arch. You feel me? Basically, I'm 21. Got a lot of time ahead of me. That's all I'm gonna say. Nah, facts, man. Definitely do it. And just like I like I said, I had to go back and hear some more songs. And the first song, I forgot what the title was, but you were singing on it. And I'm like, damn, all right, here's the joint when you in the park uh, oh, walking. Yeah, you feel yeah. me? I'm like, all right, this is a nice vibe. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> As I dig and dig and deep more, it's like, and you dance too, you feel me? I see yeah. you on a, the Instagram clips <laughs> dance while well, real talk, bro. So real it's like, rip. that just show a lot of personality, you feel me? But yeah. it's versatility as well, you know what I'm saying? Of course. So let's, let's take it. I said we want to get to know you. Let's take it all the way back. You remember, you feel me, K-Live. You yeah. remember your first song you dropped, your first studio session? Oh, yeah. I actually recorded that in my room. Yeah? My first song is called Feeling So Drippy. Feeling So Drippy. Yeah. Now, you dropped that a little later on down, right? Nah. Uh, I think it wasn't my exactly first song, but. I want to know that first my song. First, my very first song? First song. Oh, man. Take, take him back. I want to know that first song. All right. My first song. I believe it was the song I made for my man Feast. Just wanna fly. Just wanna. I like just wanna fly. Yeah. Duh, you you know what joke. I yeah, tell, tell us a little bit about just wanna fly. All right, just wanna fly. Basically, my man, shit, that was my guy. We was in school and all that. We was busting it up a lot, but he he got stabbed and shit on Forty Six and Market, and that shit hit me like it hit me hard. Like, right. And I remember him telling me, yo, you should just. Keep rapping, do do what you do, cause I ain't really record songs before that song. So he's like, just keep doing what you're doing, bro. Boom. Then I hear he got stabbed on the news. I'm just like, damn. Like, that's the clip you used at the end, right? Yeah, I wanted to ask you that it was like that a real clip at the end, cause it said yeah. the 14 year old boys. I mean, a 16 year old dude got stabbed or stabbed somebody. Yeah, that was the real clips, like, and I'm just like, man. I perform. I actually performed the song at his funeral. Wow. And like, yeah, I bust down in tears, but. You mean that's still my dog? There's one person I do it for, for real. Facts, bro. <clears throat> like that, like I said, bro. That's that's why I wanted to get to know you. Feel me? Cause yeah. you, it's so much. You, 
you could tell you've been through for you to be 21, you experienced a lot of different things, you feel me? Especially living in the hood, you know how that go, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, definitely, just, definitely. It could be from going to school, going to the poppies, chase, anything, you know what I'm saying? You just never know what you're going into. Right. You know what I mean? Let's, 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 now from, from, uh, what you said, uh, uh, Just Wanna Fly? Yeah. Just Wanna Fly to Who The Ops. Tell, like, <laughs> damn, bro, like, from the studio, uh, studio, uh, studio sound, you know what I'm saying? Uh, bars, content, it's like same type of content, but more mature. Tell me about your yeah. growth. Basically, it's like I always had different type of flows, but now that as more people coming in the music industry, it's it's having me see all right, I can expand, like what's what's next? What can I do next? Like it's a couple pre like the baby. The baby hit the scene, I'm just like, damn, he different. I ain't never heard nobody that sound like me. Right. I'm like, that could be me. I can be different. I ain't got still nobody stuff. But that's the same reason I got different type of flu. So as I'm getting older, I'm learning more shit and I'm going through more shit that help me make music more. Because when you go through something, that's the best time to make a song. Yeah, facts. Real, real, real. And then putting it on record. Like, <clears throat> why, just you've been doing this for how, how long? About five years? Yeah, but, about, uh, I've been doing it about eight years. When I recorded yeah. my first song about five, six years ago. So let's yeah. talk about that first three, that first three years, because that's like preparation. You feel me? Yeah. So tell me a little bit about that, because it's like a lot of times people wait to get in the studio because it's like they scared of what the outside gonna think or they're yeah. not comfortable with themselves. So <clears throat> how did you get to where you at with that? Well, everybody used to just tell me. I used to try to fit in, but everybody used to just try like just be yourself, just be yourself. So I'm like, all right, drop uh. I just want to fly because that was from the heart. That was from the heart. Facts. So I dropped that and I started getting gaining the buzz in school. So I'm like, all right, bet. Now I know what to do. You're like, for real, for real, yeah. Now I don't know if this was like the exact order because I see like on uh, SoundCloud, I saw like the last song that you have listed as uh, K Live was uh, I Know. <laughs> yeah. You filmed that? You got deep in that shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But then it's like you turned it around. The first song introduced to Kipiano was bad vibes. Yeah. So blew up. That jumped damn, right up. Just tell me about both of that that just transition because you could tell it's like it's like you put it all out there and I know like yeah. you was real vulnerable, real honest. You know what I'm saying? Then you came out with bad vibes yeah, yo. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Bopping. You can hear you bopping in the studio recording that yeah. joke. You know what I'm saying? So tell me about that that phase, right. that transition. So alright, I was going through something with my chick or whatever. Uh we broke up, whatever, but we still cool to this day, you mean but we broke up, whatever. And I just was in my feelings that day. I'm just like, I gotta make a song. Like, I gotta tell you how I feel. So I made that joint, put that joint out. I ain't really, like, it didn't do as many numbers as I thought it was gonna do, but it still did numbers. So I'm just like, all right, cool. Plus, I'm still, I'm actually still thinking about doing a video to that song. Like, a lot of, a lot of my old songs I'm thinking about doing videos to, but basically the transition, I just like, I'm just like, yo, let me hop on my feelings and get in my bag. Like, that's when I made Bad Vibes. I heard this beat come on. It wasn't even, I didn't click the beat. It was on, I think it was an ad. It was an ad. I clicked it. I was listening to the ad while I was listening to beats. But that was an ad and I heard the ad. The beat was an ad. So I said, oh, dumb as shit. But y'all know what no, I mean. No, I feel it. I feel it. <laughs> so I clicked it. I'm just like, this joint actually hot. And I never, I'm like, I'm going to try something new because I, I don't ever rap like this. Mm -hmm. This is when all them flows start kicking in. So I'm making a song. Told you that I love you, baby. That shit was pretend. Now I'm in my bag. Now I don't I don't even love you no more. Now I'm in my bag. Now I'm talking my shit. That's what made me make that song. And then Bad Vibes took off. Like, it took off. Yeah. It should have took off more, but it took off. Man, that's all a process, bro, right? Yeah. It took off exactly how I was supposed to, because who's not to say that took off so much? Then when yeah. you got who the op, uh, uh, you feel me? That don't take off how I was taking off, you know what I'm saying? Rap, yeah. So it's like everything, everything happened for a reason, you know what I'm saying? Of course. Uh, I want to know, all right. Now, uh, uh, throw it off. <laughs> Tell me your mindset going into throw it off. Oh, uh, you, you let it yeah. out, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> All right, well, throw it off. I made that when I came home. I got booked for some dumb shit. I can't really talk about that. Yeah, but, fact. Uh, basically, niggas I was cool with turned they back on me and shit. You know, talk. You know how that get. They talk. And it got me caught up in the situation. So now I'm booked. Boom. I can't. I got bailed out with, like, I was only in there for like a week or two, but I came home just like, shh, I, don't, I don't even care about this music shit no more. I'm, I'm strictly about to go to the street shit. 
So I hopped in the streets and shit, I, shit got real, you feel me? Shit was happening. So I'm just like, you know, everybody should be like, yo, you, it's, you really crazy. Like, there's something wrong with you. Like, you really throw the dog. So I'm like, that just kept playing in my head. So I'm like, I might just make a song. Like, it wasn't even, it's crazy because the beat that it's actually on wasn't to that, to, to that beat. I forgot what beat it was, though, but. I just start writing, and I'm just like, I'm so dope, dog. I'm just in my head, just vibing. And I just wrote to that shit, like, that shit was crazy. Look, look, this is what we're going to do, right? We're going to take it to one commercial break, you feel me? Yo, we about to be Super Bowl Sunday and Pro Bowl weekend. Matter of fact, check out last year's clips. What's up? We at halftime. It's the halftime show. The Boom Cup Celebrity Pro Bowl Showdown. We got Ricky Ross. He, he getting it jumping back. The, the two. Ricky Ross in the building, man. Takeover files. Halftime show. Boom cups. Unstyled view. The biggest boss out here, man. Said we take it We just got to hear first, he's strapping Julian Newman and he dropping 50, bro. Ooh, kill him. Who holds and rides, you better move. Hey, Kim, I'm dead. Get shut up like shine, that's on my neck. I'm big like Giddy, damn it. I'm Do you think you can beat Chris Johnson and Devin Hester the right now? Easy. Easy. 40, that's it. I'm a 40 man. Anything over 40, they got me. But 40 or less, I don't like nobody. But Earlier, we interviewed Dom and he said in a foot race in the 40. He said he's smoking y'all. How you feel about that? He got to me back in 2006, 2007. He can get it. Hottest motherfucking men in the world. Can I cuss? All right. Hottest motherfucking men in the world. Your hair is going down like Bobby motherfucking Brown. Why you not playing tonight, first of all? I didn't know nothing about this shit. I didn't... <laughs> I knew she was a boxer after what she just did in the ring. I didn't know you was a comedian now, too. <laughs> That's your boy. I mean, I don't know. Little Terry, ooh, kill him. Kill him. Uh. I'm, just, I'm going crazy, real crazy. Like, I'm trying to, I'm, I'm going crazy, stupid. Hey, yo, hey. Bro, I need to hand you a coat. Woo, we about to get it lit. All right, bro. Defensive player to you. Yeah, got to. Got to, got to go get it. Got to go eat. So, uh, you know, I'm going to go ahead and accept the MVP trophy right now. Yeah, I'm presenting it to you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm the MVP. The real MVP right here. Um, well, this is my third annual event, you know, and I just want to do something, give back to the com community and stuff like that. So this is a big, big charity event, you know what I'm saying? So we're going to be doing a lot of donating, a lot of giving back and stuff like that. So, you know, it's going to be big. Getting the strong walk of fame. Nothing is better than that, Joy Batana. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for having me in your city. Thank you. No problem, man. Glad you're here. The one and only, Joy Batana. Take over files. Unstealth you. Take 6060. Take over files sports. I know y'all ready because we, we, we about to bring it to y'all real crazy, man. Once again, make sure y'all follow our Instagram uh, uh, January 24th through January 27th. Then... Uh, man, just the whole, for the rest of the playoffs, just follow us. Take over Foul Sports, man. We back right now, my man Keith Yano. And like I said, bro, like, who the ops, that John, that, that grabbed me in, that grabbed a lot of people in, but I feel yeah. like as they listen to your portfolio and the stuff you've been doing and, and what you got to come, just just don't take your foot off the gas, bro. Yeah. Don't take your foot off the gas, man. Let me know about the, about, you know, the steam that keep that train running. Let me know about your squad, your team. I'm keeping it mean, like. My guys, I got a little tone, and also my artists. You feel me? I got a label, hundred grand. It's like they not really signed to me, but they co sign You feel me? So I, they under my wing. You feel me? Got a little tone. Me, I got little bands, and I got my DJ behind me that always back me. DJ Realist, You feel me? So they just keep me going. You feel me? Shout out J Trap too. You already know that's my dog. Self made feast. I got a lot. Man, I got a big team. I mean, they're not all here, but I got a big team. Trust me. They just keep me going. When I want to stop, they keep me going. And I keep them going. That's how I'm supposed to go. All right, so I was about to say, what's the importance? Like, give me a situation <clears throat> where you, you really fell back in a team. Like, you feel like somebody was just, like, came through for you. It ain't got to be, like, music-related. It just could have been as a as a person, person, individual, individual. You feel me? Basically, listen. I got a problem, they're going to slide. It's as simple as that. And if they got a problem, I'm sliding out. Fast, uh, so we always got each other back no matter what. It don't even matter the situation. 
I'm like, all right, bro, I need some studio time. All right, I got you. I'll go ahead with you. Let me go ahead with you. I'll pay for your video. A lot of people don't understand like that, that when yeah. they're in teams, bro. And that's that's what's going on. You keep your solid team together, but that's the foundation, bro. For like, sure. Keep the thorough ones around you, bro. Like, I heard you saying a little bit about you from the day one, and we ain't going to get too much into what you are saying, yeah. but I feel you, bro. I come that same way. Real, real. You know what I'm saying? Because, <laughs> like, I promise you, I'll be coming that same way. But it's like, you just, all I'm with my advice to you, bro, take, take, a, take things with a grain of salt. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? You, know, you, you can stun on them without flexing on them. If that for makes sure. sense. Yeah, you know what definitely, for sure. But definitely kick up with it. Man, but um, for the rest of this joint, let us know anything you want them to know about you. Talk your talk, man, because you be talking about what you, you be stomping on niggas, bro. That video was <laughs> lit, bro. That video was right, lit, right. bro. I'm yeah. keeping it big. I know when you saw that video, you was like, what the? Yo, shout out to Tom Asia, yo. Like, he fucked that video all the way up, I swear to God. Like, so who were the stuff? <laughs> <laughs> Facts, <laughs> dude, that's all heavy, bro. I didn't even expect, and that's one of them joints I wasn't even gonna drop. That's funny, I wasn't gonna drop that song, but everybody, I posted, I posted two songs, I posted two songs on my gram. I'm like, which one should I drop? I'm just feeling the other one, but everybody like, drop who the ops, who the ops, who the. I'm like, right, let me drop this joint because that's what they want. You know what they want. I dropped that joint. I'm like. I see how I went up on, on uh, SoundCloud. I'm like, damn, I gotta shoot a video to this shit. Nice. Real rap. Right. Shot the video, a couple people came through. That shit. Scoop Paul, DJ Crazy seen it, got me performing at Galaxy. All that. Shout out DJ Crazy. Touch hey, my shout guy. out Crazy. GP, Philly on some shit. Got him on that. It's just taking off. Like, I got a radio, I got a radio interview Thursday oh, with a- DJ Love. That's a good joint. Yeah, bro. Cher- bro, cherish these times because this is the fun times. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. Take it all in. Gain as much knowledge as you can. You're going to hear a lot of bullshit, but you know what I'm saying? You know you're going to be able to separate the, yeah, the right, real right. from of the course. nutty. You know what I'm saying? Real but yeah, bro, man, let them, let us know what you got coming up. Let us know your plans. Just just talk that Yano talk. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm going to call it, that Yano, Yano talk. Talk. <laughs> talk that Yano talk. All right, well, shit. We got... um. Uh, basically, we got some shit. I got an album coming. I ain't even been talking about that. It's called Rose That Never Grew. So mm. it's going to have, like, every type of vibe on that album. Like, it's not a mixtape. It's an album. I'm saying, like, 12 to 16 songs, maybe. This is going to be basically all my unreleased tracks that I've just been saving over the years. So mm. it's going to have me, generations of me, you feel me? So it's just gonna be different. I mean, I got it's like a best of. Like yeah, the best of, Facts. like real rent. But I got some. I got a video. I got a song called Spaz. I might shoot a vid too soon. Okay. I got a couple vids with uh, bands in tone about to come. I swear y'all, y'all gonna let these you know. Uh, I got my DJ moving out. You already know, man. He's going crazy right now. He working on a Philly mixtape. So any unsigned artist, you mean that want to get their song on a, a legit playlist or mixtape, is Hit DJ Rillis up at DJ Rillis on Instagram. Right. Feel me? Yeah. Yeah, we got a lot of shit going on. Uh, I was, had a show in Baltimore the other day, but I couldn't go because I was sick. A lot of people was mad at me, but I'm going to make it up to him. I got him. Yeah, I mean, so the body right first healthy, before you do anything. Healthy. Yeah, I make sure I'm healthy. But, yeah, that's about it. Like, we just going to take off 2020. That's all I'm saying. Like, we already started taking off and it's only January. You feel me? Facts. So, y'all, just, y'all going to see. I ain't going to see no more. Y'all going to see. Hey, bro, listen, man. Keep that energy. You know what I'm saying? Keep that message. Okay, stay consistent. Keep the bars coming, bro. Just keep being you, bro. Like, don't, don't let nobody change up. Don't let that. You got them now by doing what yeah. you've been doing over the past eight years. You know what I'm saying? Right. Just keep your... Family tight, keep your squad tight, keep that music coming, bro, and take over this motherfucker, bro. You, are ready. you feel me? I appreciate you for coming on the show, man. I'm at Keefiano, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to his YouTube page. Check his videos out. Subscribe to SoundCloud. Subscribe to Instagram. You got Twitter? No, no Twitter, you got it. <laughs> I was about, all right, subscribe to Instagram. Any, just type in Google Keefiano, you feel me? And, um, yeah, just, just sit tight. And enjoy this journey with us. It's your boy Little Takeover, man. Triple T shots on the mother camera.